Hi there, welcome to another Flutter tutorial. In this tutorial, we'll learn about grid view. So our final product will look look like this, where uh, a grid contain image and text. So let's get started. In our main file, we have this bunch of predefined code. Let lead them and write our own. So let uh, create my app class first. Mm, stateless my app so currently we are dealing with stateless widget mm, so return material app uh, in its home uh, return custom class my home screen let's create that class here which is also stateless so my home screen so return scaffold here and scaffold and provide app bar as app bar provide this title as text grid view example let's start reload it cool our title appears here now we'll deal with grid view from uh, grid view so our grid view dot builder import the necessary argument and here we pass silver grid with fixed cross axis count here we can uh, give our number of um, uh, number of grids in cross axis so i let's say two for now and again add the require method item builder and one thing we again need to define is item count so we will assume to have a 10 items so inside uh, item builder let's return just a de detector de it is the list of detector inside it we can define on tab action on grids so your action on grids uh, whenever you tap uh, on grids you can define your action here now provide a child card for this and was error error why this error occur oh sorry the bracket should be parenthesis okay define its child uh, stack since uh, we have to uh, we have to view a uh, uh, text uh, in image so we'll use stack inside that Stack. Let's define children and define a container where we'll uh, store the image. Container. Inside it, let's decorate the image. Mm, box decoration. Box inside this image decoration image and provide here uh, image mm, I will give here a network image will provide here a URL so <coughs> let's create uh, another container for text uh, give its height uh, I will give it 40 and color as a 
colors dot indigo okay so it's child text where we'll write image name image name let us pick an image okay i will pick the flutter logo and the studio let's have to load cool a flutter image now we have to put this image uh, container uh, in bottom so let's give alignment alignment edge fractional offset dot mm, bottom center okay and we also have to provide the alignment for this container alignment alignment dot center okay let's start reload it cool this is what we actually want now this is the static image that is only one url is there and only image name is displayed now we are uh, trying to um, add multiple image and multiple name of that image so for this let us create a new file uh, give it name as store uh, dot dot in this file we will store some image uh, url and their names so we will uh, cache that image url and names in main dot so create a class call store or anything you like Class C should be small. Okay, so we will give image name here, and again in a string. Uh, item image. Now store dot item terms constructors created and this dot image name this dot oh sorry I don't know image name okay string image name okay make it small and we'll put list store and make a variable store items is equals to st or store item is equals to store dot items item image comma item image name okay uh, let's find some image uh, and it and it image let pick this one or this one let's pick this one copy image address and item image let's paste the url here and name it at android similarly add other items okay provide the multiple url i will give this url also okay see mm, i've pasted it and named that flutter 
again YouTube Oops, sorry YouTube YouTube let's guess this image URL mm, coffee image address and paste is here YouTube and similarly you can do others also now our job is to <coughs> catch that um, images here dynamically so first of all change this item count to store items dot length so it will give us error because we haven't import it so let's import it okay let's okay there's something store image let's import store items okay let's try to import it manually import store dot that so item count must be store store item okay, let me make this small one and try again store store item that length it should work now yes why shouldn't it work <laughs> Store items, items. Okay, where this? Yeah, I think this should be here. Okay, this should work now. Store. items okay dot length so what the what this code general does it it will automatically find the number of items and uh, make its length as at the that items so simple uh, here we pass store items dot item image here index and in image name store items dot okay where the bracket store item dot items name and provide the index and provide the index so let's how to load it let's reload it and cool it works